germ layers. Germ layers are different layers of tissue that form within an organism during its early development. The main three layers you should know about in biology are the ectoderm, the endoderm, and the mesoderm. Let's go through each. The ectoderm is the outermost layer of an embryo. This layer becomes the skin and the nervous system. You can remember ectoderm by breaking off its prefix, ecto, meaning out. Think of out as the outermost layer of your body, such as the skin. And all over your skin includes uh, touching, feeling, sensing receptors, which are nerves. So include the nervous system when you think of ectoderm. The endoderm layer, endo meaning in, is the innermost layer seen here under C. This layer becomes the digestive system. To remember this, first remember that endo means in and try to think of a gut instinct. And when you think of gut, think digestion. Or just remember that endo has a D, which stands for a digestive system. And finally, the mesoderm. This is the middle layer of an organism, outlined here as B. This layer becomes the blood muscles, um, sorry, the blood and the muscles. Think it starts with an M, so it means the middle layer, and think M for muscles. It also becomes your bones, so think that this layer has the only S in each of these layers, so think skeletal, skeletal system. So remember that the three germ layers in animals developed greater complexity over the evolutionary timeline. And the three in order from outer to inner are ectoderm, mesoderm, and endoderm. Our earliest organisms only consisted of two germ layers, the ectoderm and the endoderm.